I'm Connor. I'm Matt. And we're Magnificent Beard. Hi. <laughs> Do that again. Okay. Do you want to say we're Magnificent Beard together? Not really. I do. <laughs> we're Magnificent Beard together. You start. I'm Connor. I'm Matt. We're Magnificent Beard. This is our studio in the East Dallas slums. We moved out of the Mole Man Caves we were in. The overlords drove us out. It's terrible and bleak. Um, and this is where we spend all of our days. Uh, and that's why we're so white. We, uh met each other in ninth grade and pretty much have been just attached ever since. We're screen printers and illustrators and designers by night. We're terrible admin and art directors by day at soul-sucking day jobs. It's great fun and it gives us money to do this which will one day maybe we can flip it. Let's show you some really cool posters that we've done. Wu-Tang Clan was a lot of fun. This idea basically came from 10 years ago when we really liked the Wu-Tang and watched all their DVDs a lot. That was our favorite thing to do. And so we thought, DVDs, yes, of course. Oh, one's missing, because sadly ODB's dead. Stars was a pretty straightforward one. Their album's called Five Ghosts. So it's kind of a five piece Matryoshka thing. This was probably the most intense one we did for uh, Sebado, where we actually, we bought a cake at uh, Tom Thumb, told them to write Sebado really big and all this other stuff smaller, and we knew we couldn't do it because we'd try and make it look a certain way, or it wouldn't look bad, and it had to look bad on purpose. And so we got that done, dropped it, took a picture, and then we printed it um, in four color process, which is CMYK, and it's the first time we ever tried that. Here's the final deer hoof poster. So it was just three colors. And we hope it didn't make Ian Tearson too mad. We're 80s kids. Yeah. We grew we up like in the 80s and we like... Comic books, video games, booze. Although we do remember not having cell phones and... Uh, or internets. Yeah, or internet. We pretty much have both been doing art all of our lives. Um, you know, drawing and... That was it, and then it was like, you know, time to figure out how to make a living off of it. So graphic design made some sense. We approach it as designers first, because we had concept nailed into our head for so long. And we try and approach everything stylistically from what's appropriate for the band. So that's why all, so much of our stuff looks completely, uh, completely different, I guess. We don't try to be something we're not. I mean, this is... Doing this ourselves, we, this is 100% us. Um, we're doing what we'd be doing if we didn't have to work. We're weirdo creepers, so it's better that you know that right off the bat. We try to, for the most part, do posters for bands that we enjoy, and we try to do it so we get more involved, as opposed to, uh, I just need to knock out a poster. It's really cool, I think, to... to be involved in that uh, in a way that we know how since we're not musicians. Um, so I think this is kind of a way to be rock stars outside of. As close as we can get to being in the band. Sure. <laughs>